All right. So I now want to get into a topic that I want your perspective and expertise on. Sure. And I'll just start it off like this. So music is very powerful and it can play an instrumental part in different aspects of our lives, right? Can you get into how music can make walks, hikes, or treks better and how it can open up your mind? Such a great question. And I've been mulling over this for since our last conversation. Um, for me, the easiest way I can describe it is it's like having your own personal soundtrack. We've all seen amazing movies and what movies with soundtracks can do. And for me, having something tailor-made for outdoor experiences or for yourself, it will just make that experience so much better because there's something special about music, isn't there? There's something that there really is. I mean, natural, sorry, nature sounds, of course, amazing, without a doubt. But just hearing the right song at the right moment is just, it can just make any moment seem a thousand times better. For me, it's just imagining that you're in a movie. That's that's the way I can describe it. You know, it it, it genuinely is the best way. Um, when I was touring across the US, I had a song that I would listen to every time the plane would land in a new city. And it just made me feel like, you know, I would look out the window and it just made me feel like I was in a TV show or something. You know, it was just this great feeling. Um, and for me, having all these amazing things you can look at in front of you, just having the perfect music to it just makes it all so much better, I think. Yeah, so I love the sounds of nature and silence as well. Mm. But to your point, I also really love having the perfect soundtrack, like what you just said, depending on the moment yeah. I'm in. Sure. And for example, it's like when I'm like watching a beautiful like sunset or like a sunrise, mm. like it's already gorgeous, right? As is by itself. But if you play like the right music to accompany it, it just becomes like this super enhanced, like super HD quality moment, you know, completely. For you. Again, a best way to describe it is if you're going to have like a really nice dessert, it's like having whipped cream on the dessert. You don't need it, <laughs> but it makes it nicer. Oh, thousand percent. Yeah. You know, that's how I can imagine it. It's just, is it something you can add to it? But of course, n you know, nature sounds are, in are incredible. I've seen, mm -hmm. I've been very lucky to witness some beautiful sunsets and sometimes just hearing the waves or the birds is just incredible it's just the best thing but for someone like me who is a music lover having the perfect soundtrack it just makes it just that little bit more you know enjoyable for me oh it's a lot of it's a lot a bit more because i feel <laughs> when you have that song with that moment it's like that experience of like seeing that sunset or like even a waterfall or whatever it is right yeah i feel that it becomes like a even more of a forever memory and that it's, a, it's like even more emotion is involved with that moment and it creates mm -hmm. like this more long-term memory and it just intensifies and you just become like more engaged about that like experience. Like it just, I've had some moments myself too. I'm just like, I was listening to an FKJ song on the top of one of the tallest mountains in uh, Malibu out here in Los Angeles. And I just, it just like, I had an epiphany. I felt like on the summit, <laughs> you know, like it was just it's unreal. Really interesting. It's really interesting you say that because if you're enjoying something visually, the sound of the wind or the birds might not necessarily take you back to that place again. However, a song will. You know, you bring up such a great point. I completely yeah. agree because it's more distinct mm. in your mind. Yeah, exactly. So I think that's, for me, I always like to um, associate songs with certain moments, which is why I would listen to that one song every time I landed in New City, because I am a bit of a nervous flyer. Um, mm -hmm. I'm not so nervous to the point when I can't get on the plane, but I will still have nerves getting on the plane, taking off landing. And every time I landed, I listened to this song. When I listen to the song again, I know things are going to be okay because I made that my things are okay moment. So yes. if that makes sense, you know. Yeah, you can tap into it. Yeah, that's it. When you say like music can open up your mind, can you just elaborate on that a bit more? Because I totally get it. I just want the listeners to maybe hear what you your perspective on that is again it's such a good question um for me uh, how can i describe this i think see i don't have synesthesia which is you can see colors when you listen to music i don't have that i'm really jealous that i can't do that um but for me when i listen to certain music it just takes me somewhere 
And I think the fact that I can be laying in my bed or I can be on a train or driving somewhere. And the fact that music, even though if you haven't heard something before, a new song can immediately take you somewhere else. That's such an incredible thing. And I think this is where for me, the music will open up so many feelings. And um, just even, I guess, if you're able to, so for example, if you're on the train, you can close your eyes, listen to a song, and it will take you somewhere else. And I've done this where I've been on the train, eyes closed, listen to music. And before I realize I'm at my destination, because this song is just taking me somewhere. And it can be something from a movie, from a TV show, or even video games nowadays, they have incredible soundtracks. And sometimes it can be something that will take you back to when you felt like a kid, or something, something it can be somewhere watching a nice sunset or an experience or a memory with someone that you love and music can take you to these places and that's what i love but the most wonderful thing for me is is i for example can say to you hey justin there's a song it makes me think of this this and this and you listen to it and you might feel the exact same thing and and imagine the exact same thing i do or you it might take you somewhere completely different and that's what I love about music. It's like a book. I think you and I briefly discussed this before, which is why um, if you're going to watch a movie, if you've read the book beforehand, it's never going to be as good as what yes. you've imagined, you know. Mm -hmm. um, but for me with music, it can just have that effect on so many people. You know, you can kind of tell people, close your eyes and just let it take you somewhere. And I do this with my show at least once a week. One of my favorite things that I do uh, recently, the past several weeks, is remember I told you I ride my bike a lot more now? Yeah. One of my freaking favorite things to do is I'll put in the Future Beat show and sunset over here is at 5 p.m. now. And I'll ride out at 3 p.m. and I'll do a sunset bike trek and it'll Amazing. have the Future Beat show playing. And I'm just seeing the sunset coming down over the Malibu mountains. And I'm just like listening to all this music that you've been curating over the past two, three hours on the show. I'm just like, like this is the perfect soundtrack to every sunset. <laughs> like, you see, Justin, you it know what's blows crazy? my mind. What's insane is I've had people who go for jogs when the sun's rising and they're listening to the same show as you are, and they say the same thing to me. And this is what I was talking about. You know, where someone on one side of the world is enjoying the sun setting, some on the other side is enjoying the sun rising, and that's what I love about music. Sunrise and sunsets. I know we're going to get into that for sure. It's uh, some of the most special moments of the day. Of course. Um, actually, you know, let's just jump right into that, actually, since we're talking about it already. So like you said, um, on your show, you always talk about your favorite part of the day, mm -hmm. that being sunsets. Yes. So what I want to know from you is, what does a sunset mean to complexion? And like, why is it your absolute favorite? I think it's the colors more than anything. Um, there's a, something so incredible about the sky going from blue to pink orange purples you know it, it's just something so amazing and again how can i'm trying to put this into words how it makes me feel and again um just to let i know this is it and just to let everyone who's listening justin actually uh informed me about some of the questions and these are i've been thinking about this non-stop since um mm -hmm. you first told me and i still haven't been able to give you a good answer because it's it's a feeling more than anything else. You know, there's something about getting to witness witness it every day. And it's kind of, it to me, it, it puts a cap on the day, but then there's so much more you can do at night as well. So it's not the day's finished. It's kind of like, it's a reset point is how I can describe it. That's probably the best way to say. Um, but also some people say it's mother nature just showing off for a couple of minutes every day. And that is always something that's made me smile. You know, the, the earth's just like, look, I've got something to show you, you know. And um, that's such a wonderful thing to experience. And also the thing that fascinates me is that throughout the day, everyone is experiencing a sunset at a different time, you know. And that to me is just such an amazing thing. I know this, I'm not really answering the question. I'm kind of trying to dance around the question because I don't have an answer for you. I tried so hard with Justin, but I just couldn't think of something good enough. No, you check this out. You can't force it. And I like mm. your answer a lot because for a lot of us, something like a sunset or a sunrise, you can't really put it into words or articulate it. It's just, and I really loved when you said this, it's a feeling. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's just a feeling sometimes and this you don't need to maybe put words to it. No, this is it. And it's something that I feel like no matter what you do or who you are, you can appreciate a sunset. 